What's up everyone, as you know my name's Tom Techstream. Today is a bit different, I've got Adam here from Thermaltake. Hi Tom, how are you? Hi Adam. So, let's uh, go through what we've got here. It's a bit of a busy day today, I must apologise for all of the noise because I'm actually having a new front door fitted, but Adam here turned up and, well, let's make a video. <laughs> Inconsiderate of you on the front door when I arrive, isn't it? Well, I didn't get much of a choice. <laughs> it was just a case of like, well, I'm coming. That's it. You know me. And I've got to get a front door fit, otherwise the wife will tell me off. Well. Well, let's, get, let's keep the wife happy. So, <laughs> what we have here today, we have the top of the range thermal take level 20 case so that's the big monster that nobody else has got yeah this is the big one this is our big daddy our creme de la creme one of the level 20 family this was to celebrate 20 years yes this was so yeah. this is this a, a new version of the original level 10 that was that happened 10 years ago so this is a revamped version of the level 10 yeah um, everything's handmade all the five mil aluminium is all bent by hand uh, four mil tempered glass panels a three chamber design all thermal take LCS certified, so yep. your power supply at the top, you've got your main chamber then for your motherboard and radiators, then you've got your front chamber as well for the water cooling. Everything opens up with little quick release catches on the side for the doors. Oh yeah. So your power supply can go in there, all your routing holes for your cables. The power supply in this configuration is vertical. Can so that be flipped? It can be put, it can be, it can be put side mounted. The bracket on the back here, which we can turn this round, can orientate the other way. Yes. If, it, if it wasn't quite so big, I would show you now, but I will get some B-roll and show you around the back and things. Because it's not small. It's what, how many kilos was it? It's 32 kilos in weight. That's a lot of weight for a case. It is. That's, I think it that's as much case. as my entire server. <laughs> so it's uh, full EATX size. We've got the Ring Plus fans in there. Everything works with our Eco Plus system and our TTR, TTRGB Plus software. Yeah, so that would be like the flow fans and things that I've had here in the past. Um, yep, yeah. there are ring trios, uh, flow ring cooler, yeah. the ring plus fans, our level 20, key, new level 20 keyboard, and we have the M240 Plus kit as well, which all So works. obviously if you're buying something like this, you'd be better off. You, you, you're more likely to be going with one you're of these. Going with, you're gonna go, yeah, you're gonna be going with a custom loop in there anyway. Yeah. So any of our plus range, Family all works with this case. All syncs through the controllers through the yep. Thermaltake software. So, and that's, is that a vertical mount there as well? For that GPU? is a G vertical GPU mount. Yep. I saw in the box, which you've had to put away because it fills the entire it studio. Is humongous. Yeah. Is there was a cable? I did bring it in right behind me here. There we go. This is what comes in the box. So included, you do actually get one of your premium PCIe yep. 3.0. You get the 300 mil premium PCIe riser cables, which are fantastic. Very great. I've actually reviewed that and yes, they are the best on the market. And inside we get a little box of goodies. I hope we get some nice things for this because it's a you surely do. One, one of very few. So inside the box is the Ring Plus controller. Okay, so that will be... Fans. This is the same one that I've reviewed in the past? It is, yep. yep. And all of your mounting screws. And under here, there is... Or oh, there was. There was. There should be. His little key ring has gone missing. Oh no. Oh, so no. There's, there's a, you do actually get a special thermal tape key ring. Are they numbered or anything? Or? No, they're not no, numbered. No, they're just no. a nice thermal tape key ring to yeah. say thank you for spending a thousand pound on a computer case. No, it's, it's not in there. So oh, this has gone down the side yet. No, it's not in there. But I do have one. Oh, it's alright for some, isn't it? Do I get one? <laughs> I can look at There it is there. Oh, there you go. That is a nice laser etched thermal take key ring. Quite cool. So, that's the one that belongs in the box. I do not know why one is missing out of here. We, but, Although this has been travelling around the country, because Adam has actually been going up and down the UK this week, um, we we're actually the first people that have A, decided to put Adam on camera. He didn't get much of a choice in that. <laughs> and B, we pulled the level 20 out and showed it all, because what's the point in just me looking at it? I thought we'll show it to all of you. So that's the level 20 case. It's, yeah. it's a monster of a case. You, you we'll, want to call in possibilities yeah. and customization is endless. So we'll, we'll crack it open and get some more footage yeah. of that in a bit. We'll. So, so what else we have is we can get rid of this off the table. This is the uh, M240 kit. Inside it's a hard tube kit. You get your 250 mil D5 D, res. D5 point yeah. is it? You get four 500 mil hard 1612 hardline tube. 
a clear bottle of coolant, a 240 rad. Copper rad? Uh, no, that this one's are aluminium. These are the aluminium kit, yeah. So that's an aluminium block? Yes, it's, yeah. Then you get your three ring fans, CPU block, six C Pro flittings. That's these ones these here. These ones? Yeah, but in silver. Awesome. The ones on the end. Yeah. And you get two angled adapters and you get your jumper for your power supply and your silicon insert as well. So pretty much all you need to get this going is a hacksaw and... Yeah, everything you need. We can do diagrams. Yeah. Show to where you want to do your loop. Everything you need in one complete box for a CPU loop. And you can add to it if you want to add a GPU yeah. block to it for other times. So. What does one of these take you back? Uh, price of these at the moment in the UK are 339 Three, that's not bad for a yeah. D5 pump, really. Yeah. So, um, and do you do the aluminium blocks for the GPUs to go with them? The or? blocks we have for our GPUs are compatible with it. They all, are all thermal tape blocks, CPU blocks are compatible with our radiators. Okay. We do have a new uh, DDC kit coming out, yep. which is full of copper. Okay. Again, so copper is that, radiator. Is that co uh, copper, but the compromise being the pump, so similar price? Everything's copper in the new one. Awesome. Everything. I me personally, I do prefer copper because you can just pick a part and throw it in. You can, sir. We get this one out of the way so we can make yes. some room on it. So what we have here in front of us is the Thermaltake Pacific C Pro fittings. So these are the fittings that come in these that These are the fittings point. in the box, yeah, but we do them in various colours. We've got white, green, red, chrome, blue, and we have black as well, which I don't have the black box with me. But black ones? Have some loose ones. What they basically are, they are a very foolproof way of everything's foolproof until you get put in a camera <laughs> trust let's, me let's see if we can undo this now no we can't undo this bit. <laughs> let's have a go i've tightened you that oh you've undone it well done good man so oh okay that's a bit different yeah i got three pieces that's right so what oh each, and an o-ring and an o-ring so each c pro fitting has a on that is a base plate. Okay. That base plate gets attached to your radiators block, VGA block, okay. pump. So you can you have your base plate on on either part. Yep. You can then measure from point zero to point zero, so you get your measurements right. Yeah. If you've got two graphics cards in SLI together, you're not forcing the cards so apart you, you, to get you, in. You can get very close very together. Very close. Yeah. So with the C Pro fit, since they come in three parts, you've got your base plate, which has an O ring on there. Yeah. Then we have the collar. Okay. What this collar does has three O-rings inside. Yeah. So you get you've got your chamfer tube. Everything's cut to length. Yeah. Push your collar over, and just give it a tap on the table so the end of the tube becomes flush with the end okay. of the collar. Your base plate then is attached to your product. Over the top is your O-ring, and then your clamping ring. You then go into your part. You've got no way of misaligning this up. It won't thread on or it won't attach if it's not aligned. So if you're out of alignment, your collar's not going to thread on. So once it's nicely and perfectly aligned and flush with the bottom of the collar yeah. against the O-ring, just goes straight on. It, so it's not much more complicated than fitting the old-fashioned soft iron hard uh, No, soft it's not more, but it's, we, we've got four O-rings in this. So, yeah. you know, it's it's that added, you know, added security from yeah. leaks. So it's... I've been using these for so since they brought them out now. I've never had a leak with a C Pro fitting. I think Thermaltake should leave us some of these and we can do a hard line build. Would <laughs> you like to see that? Let us know in the comments down below. So there we go. With you know all various colours, so you can match it with your loop and whatever colour fluid you want to go with. Yeah. And I have some black ones here which are on there. Yeah. But they've all got all nice with a white accent ring. I must uh, admit, they're very they're very well very well machined. I mean, well, I, I do like to see some nice machining. I've played around with dodgy Chinese fittings before in the past, and you can always tell from the machining. It's the biggest giveaway, but it these, is. the threads are, are nice and smooth. Exceptional quality. I mean, anybody could really do a hard... If you were to you do, do these in 90 degrees or anything? No, you have, you, the, you have the 90, 90 degree adapters, which these yeah. then thread on. They're all G and a quarter thread, they are. You, so. You, so you could technically do a build with this without any bends? Yep, yeah, you could. You can't get much more simple than that? No. I like that. That is simple. How yeah. much is a six pack? Uh, the six pack are retailing at eighty nine ninety nine. Okay, so that's not cheap. Not cheap. Uh, it does make the M two forty kit look 
good yeah. value for money. It is with with the, with the six C Pro fittings included. Yeah. Right, when you got six C Pros at ninety pound and, yeah. and a D five pump, a D five pump's hundred pound. D five pump's hundred pound. Then you have got the radiator, you got your coolant, yeah. you got your fans, you got your jumper, your tubing, your silicon yeah. insert. So there you go. So the, yeah. although the M two forty to start off with, you might think that's pricey. Which at three hundred and forty, did you say? Uh, they, they vary between three three nine and three eight nine in the UK, depending. Yeah. On which so so you around three hundred and forty, three hundred and fifty pound. They're not cheap, but when you actually price it up, you're probably looking at nearly four hundred pound for yeah, a system. Yeah, yeah. Which, yeah. Okay, so it does make it look a lot it's, more. It's, it's, it's the it's the ideal you know starter kit. You yeah. You've got everything you need to do your CPU. Then if you want to add, add a GPU block in a further time, yeah. And it's easy to tap into and alter. It, then just put the GPU into the loop. But yeah, we do them in the M two forty and the M three sixty. Yeah. And we do the M three sixty plus as well, which links them with all our plus software. Okay. So. Well, I'll leave you with those. Thank you very much. I think those are actually a really nice addition. They're nice and simple. Yep, very nicely packaged, great colours, and they're selling very well in the UK, doing very well. So Now, we have our newest keyboard. That is the Level 20, this isn't is it? This is the Thermaltake Level 20, UK layout. This is a, a Cherry MX Silver Speed switch. Okay. So, on the box, you have the lighting and we have an LED bar that goes all the way around and, and it comes into the number pad as well. Okay. So we have the cutout in the number pad yep. and the line. And you can see by the frosted fluorescent bar. Oh yeah, so that, does, does that actually come around the back as well? Yeah, all around the back. And all this then links up with our uh, Thermaltake Sync, our RGB Plus products, yeah. Amazon Alexa. Haven't all, tried that yeah, one yet. All, all voice activated. You know, you have all your media keys, your audio, and your USB pass through. It's one thing I see a lot of actually at the moment is they, they'll they'll throw in a set of macros down the side, but then they miss out media keys. Yeah. And I do like a good scroll wheel for volume because the amount of times I get told off for turning the volume up yeah. too. We loud. have it's a brushed aluminium top, proper thick yeah. aluminium. Um, we do it in the silver and the black. The yeah. UK layout at the moment is in the black. We are bringing the silver version over. Cool. So set. All Cherry MX Silver Speed switches, all with our software. How much one of these set you back? These at the moment are 149. That's not bad money. Um, you can quite easily spend that much on other brands yeah. or um, uh, Cherry switches. Cherry all right, switches, you yeah. can get cheaper keyboards, but they never include Cherry switches. No, they don't. No, not um, not with the Silver Speed. The question as well, is, so. that cutout does it make it? No, nope. it's actually it's rigid. It's so the box it comes in. What do we get? What's this? So we've got a virtual keyboard. Yep. This is the um, exclusive mobile app, which yep. comes with the uh, Thermal Take Level 20 software. In there, in the app, you can do your colours, uh, your keyboard layout, and there's a game controller, which you can turn your phone around and use it as an actual game controller while playing does the game. Does it work? It does work very well. Well, maybe we'll have to test that one out. It does out. work very well. Everything through the mobile app is the same as the software. It's just compressed down yeah. for iOS and Android. Okay, it's available on both. Then. That's yep. all right. Yep. The amount of times, especially um, cheap unknown brands, you only get Android because yep. obviously iOS is a lot harder to get an app on there. So as, it, as it's all our Thermaltake Ring Plus, it's all 16.8 million colours. Thermaltake RGB. There's, you can't complain about it. Can't complain. I've best, got, best RGB out there. It's most expensive as well, but... Best. Well, well, he's going to say that. He's, bit, he's, he's a little bit biased, is Adam. <laughs> it's good stuff. Um, so always works fine for me. So yeah, I could, to be honest with you, I've never had any problems with it. No, um, I've had it. Well, we've got the triple fan system. I've got the standard ones. Yeah. I've got the AIO. Yeah, we've got the Ring Duos coming out, which is the same as the Ring Trios, but you haven't got the center hub LED, so they're just the front and back ring. Just get the trios. Yeah. They're a little bit more expensive, but just buy all the just buy all the RGB. The, the Ring Duos are good. Our new power supplies that are coming out have the Ring Duo fans in there as well. Yeah. That was my one problem, my, my one problem with the RGB P issue that you sent me. Yeah. Was you couldn't sync it up with anything. No, that one can sync it up. The NDA one I have is all can, but we can't show that to them. He won't, so. he won't, show, he won't even show it to me. <laughs> let, let alone show it to you. No. Um, can't show you that to me. Sorry. So I think that's it. about it for this video. That's it. Um, like I said, I'm going to throw in a load of B-roll on this level 20. It's a bit of a monster. I like it. Adam's quite impressed with it. Adam likes it. Adam wants everybody to buy one, but that's because Adam's the marketing man and they're a thousand pound a piece. Yeah. But yeah, we'll throw in a load of B-roll. Cheap. Half the, you know, cheap. Cheap for that level of quality anyway. It's, yeah, I must admit the quality yeah. is good. It is big. You're, you're getting a lot for it's your money. There's a, there's a lot of, a, 
I'm actually going to say there's a lot of love has gone into making one of them because it has it not is. just been churned out by a robot. It's not, no. All the metal is hand bent. Yeah. It's all 5 mil brushed aluminium. Um, tempered glass panels. It's all assembled by hand, not by machine. Yeah. Everything on there just has a loving touch and, you know, double boxed, extra protection and it's, the catches, just everything works. Just yeah. everything is phenomenal. Yeah. Right. It's well, a great case. I think that's about it then for today from Adam. Is it? So thank you very much Adam for coming down. Thank you very much. It's, Thanks uh, for having me it's on actually the been a pleasure to actually see you come all the way down to my <laughs> little island. Um, and not just come down just for the sake of it, but actually come down, bring us a load of goodies that otherwise I wouldn't have got to show you because there was no chance Adam was going to send me one of these. <laughs> not yet. Not, not yet. Not we're yet. Get, we're getting there. We're, we're 30,000 views a month we're, now. We're, get, we're getting there. So um, um, I'm going to leave you with Tom. They do the beauty shots of that. We'll see you in, around and we'll show you some more goodies soon. Yeah, well there you go then guys. Don't forget, click the subscribe button, any comments down below. Let me know if you want Adam to send me goodies. Because we want one of these. We do. Up on camera now, one's on the way to you. There we go. There you go. There we go. So there you go. And on that note guys, I'll see you all again next week. See you soon.